Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Most Wanted channel. It's been a while, I know. Thank you guys for waiting for us. Uh, me and Jenna have been, you know, busy with our work because of the pandemic. We have been locked down in our country for quite some time. We didn't really travel a lot because the last time we went to the Lang Tengah uh, Island. After that, we went to another lockdown again. So, uh, we didn't go anywhere. Basically, just stay home, stay safe take care of ourselves and our, our family and after almost one year we are back on the road again and this time we make a short trip down to the south of Malaysia the state of Johor and we came to this beautiful place today you know we are on a mission today basically uh, we, we are on a golf trip this week basically uh, just two of us you know play golf and have some fun and currently right now we are here in the Desaru coast which is a new developed area that uh, you know a lot of resorts have been built over here just to cater uh, for the tourists especially tourists from the Singapore but unfortunately right now you know the border is not open yet that's why a lot of people are traveling domestically they also visit here as uh, part of their holiday destinations as well um, the good news is, you know, the borders are opening in a few days. Today, it's the March uh, 16. Uh, the borders are opening on the 1st of April. But we have no plans yet to travel anywhere uh, around the world because we, we want to wait and see how the situation is like later on. Then we only uh, start to travel back again. So currently, right now, we are at the driving range just to warm up and also make a few practice shots before we officially tee off our first hole and we are here in the, this beautiful uh, golf course uh, the Els Desaru as you can see this is a world-class uh, championship level uh, golf course right here impressive uh, looks amazing as well and can't wait to try it out and, and play here right We are here at our second hole, which is a par 3 hole. I managed to hit it just outside of the green. I need to do a chip here. It's a really nice chip, just landed in front of the hole. Janet is doing a long part here. Oh. Go in! Go in! Aiyya. That is so close. And this is my chip. Which is really nice shape, just landed in front of the hole. I need to hit it one part to be a par. Nope. Get her. Second hole. And she's already tired. No. <laughs> Not me. I should play worse than Vincent in driving range, but surprisingly I'm better today. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I just I just can't get the feel feeling today. Uh, maybe the scenery is too beautiful here and it draws my attention away and it's really impressive the the greeneries here are amazing look at yeah the view over here as you can see the buildings behind that i believe that's the resorts anantara uh, the one that we are staying in tonight and the reason we make a trip that's so far away from kuala lumpur is because the uh yeah the well-known greeneries here this is a world-class golf course and we wanted to give it a try although it's our her second time and my third time playing golf in, in a golf course but we just want to get a good experience you know have a good trip that's why we are here right? yeah i can't wait to show you more uh, about this golf course because um, we have been picking up this hobby in the pandemic so i guess we can have a better more um, travel videos for you in terms of like golfing new hobbies so stay tuned to more content from us yep Yep, let's hope on to the next hole, hole number three, which is the par five. Right, let's go. The reason why we actually pick up golf, it's because of me. Uh, 
my whole family is a golfer. My brothers, uh, they play golf. They know how to play golf. My parents, my mom, my father, they are golfer too. Uh, but I'm the only one, you know, that doesn't know how to play golf in the family. So I do not want to disgrace my family. So I want to have these practices in the fam uh, in, in our family culture. That's why I decided to learn golf as well. And uh, also because due to the pandemic, we are unable to go anywhere. Uh, even we can't go to the uh, gym or we can't play badminton because it's uh, indoor. Uh, owning golf is allowed, you know, back in the lockdown period. So I, I told Janet, why not we start picking up golf, start learning golf. And we actually signed up a lesson, golf lessons, uh, 15 weeks lessons. And surprisingly, we, we found uh, it very interesting and we, we fell in love in it and we started to really play uh, intensively we go to the driving range almost uh, at least once a week or twice a week just to make sure that we pick up quickly yeah actually it's a very hard sport for me because I don't you have to coordinate every part of our body yep. so at first when you are in it right you just feel like everything just don't go like as you wish but when you get a hang of it it is very addictive Yep. And um, I actually played very bad at first, but now not as good, but it's not we, too bad. We, we consider we are still newbie, but we are we are picking up as a hobby, yeah, just for fun. Not not really like you know we want to win a tournament. No, not that's not our goal. Our goal just to <laughs> pick up a hobby together, spend time with each other. You know, come out to the green, just away from our work, our office, our 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 house. You know, just get out to the to the open air to to get some fresh air and also. Uh, get some tan yeah I sun. guess even though we can't travel so this is at least something that we can pick up as a hobby so it's kind of healthy and also um, we can show you you know different destinations as golf is also a, a very popular um, sports and also destinations around the world so yeah. if we can show you you know like nice resorts and so we can show you like good, good cor golf courses around the world so yeah hopefully this is something that we can have it in our contents so let's see if we can show you more in our next 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 show videos if you play golf you always have to be cautious because see you never know what you will can find what kind of pokemon you will find in the golf course and this is a monitor lizard it's one of the common species you will find in the golf course and one of the rare species we found it in the water over there there are seven or eight otters over there uh, playing around right if you look closely they are in the water swimming around right and that's my golf ball over there just right next to the water That's right over there at the pin at the right top there. Now she's trying to hit it, right? Uh, it's about 300 meters away from here. She takes a lot of time sometimes, but yeah, golf is a slow spot. That's a good shot. Oh my God. Just right under the tree over there. So that's a good shot, not bad for us right our goal is just to keep it in the fairway this turn it's fine but as long as we keep it within the fairway you can still see the ball you're able to hit it that's considered a good shot for us hi guys so we just finished the first nine hole and now we are going to the next nine hole which is the ocean coast one which is the ocean coast is also their signature coast it's the most beautiful uh, nine holes here in the else uh, de saru right now let's go, let's go. all right let's tee off uh, the first nine hole is not that great, you know, we are trying to get that feeling. We are only able to pick it up after six or seven holes. Now we are... Ready to go. Yeah, we are ready to go. We are playing better right now. Slightly better. Not great, but slightly better. Yeah, let's go. It's amazing out here, you know, enjoying the breeze, the sea breeze, because the ocean is just right behind us over there and you know listen to the birds singing and so on it's just feel really relaxed over here and yeah although it's really sunny because this morning on the way here it was drizzling and it was a bit rainy and we are glad that now the clear the, the sky have cleared up really and now it's all blue just sky blue yeah actually this is really the nicest uh hole 
if you look at this, it is quite wide, so you can enjoy the breeze and then you can actually play the golf like while looking at the scenery. Yep. As you can see, like right here. Yeah. Oh, let's go to we are halfway to the green. So let's go. This is their signature hole, the ocean course hole number two. Right? Remember, if you come here, if you visit here, you must play the ocean course. Uh, there are two different golf courses here. Uh, it's actually by the Els. You know, one is the ocean course and one is the valley course. We'll be playing the valley course two days later. And this is our first day here in Desarable. We are playing here at the ocean course. And yeah, we just want to enjoy the, the most beautiful course here first. Quack. Nope. Look how beautiful is this golf course. Currently we are at the green of second hole and you can see this is right behind it's the beach. If you are a golfer, if you manage to visit to Malaysia, this is one of the top golf courses you must visit here in Malaysia. Beside Johor in Desaru, the Els also have another golf club in the Langkawi, which is our one of the popular uh, island in Malaysia. So we just ended our golf uh, experience here in the Els, Desaru, the ocean course. We just finished our 18 holes. Now we just uh, finish, you know, refreshing ourselves in, in wash in, a little bit. Yeah, just to wash up a little bit, to refresh ourselves. Now we are heading to their lunch because uh, our lunch is also included by them as well. So let's check their lunch out. So this is the lamb biryani that Janet ordered. It comes with the papadum, which is the Indian fried bread. And they have also condiments for it. I think some uh, salad with yogurt. And this is the lamb biryani. And they have also curry on the side. And we also order a side dish, uh, chicken gyoza, which is fried chicken dumplings, Japanese dumplings. Looks amazing. Color looks uh, golden brown. Wonderful. And I order their signature big and easy burger, which is their most famous dish in this restaurant. Right, looks huge. Look, this is my hand and that's the burger. So inside I think they have fried egg, bacon, beef patty and come with a side french fries as well. Right, let's stick in. So guys, we just came back from our golf uh, this morning. We just checked into our hotel, took a shower and freshened up ourselves. So yeah, currently we are here in our room, uh, which is quite comfortable. <laughs> like it's, it's, you, you know, feel like sleeping already. Yeah, it's really tired because after a long drive this morning from Johor Bahru, uh, one hour driving trip to, to come to here in Desaru and after four, four and a half hours of playing golf, uh, it's quite tiring and yeah, it's good, you know, because it's quite sunny out there today. Now, I feel a bit uh, sun. I get some sunburn as you can see, it's already tan. Luckily, it's actually not raining because if it's raining, we don't even get to play. So. It's sunny, but it's not that hot, so we are grateful for the weather itself. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, I just I feel a bit dehydrated right now as well, so I think we need to drink a lot of water. Uh, a lot of people think that golf is an expensive uh, sport and also old man sport. Actually, that's not true. I would say it depends how you see it, <laughs> because yeah, you know, buying equipments and and other stuff, golf golf equipment and other stuff, it's quite uh, expensive sometimes, but. If you think in the long term investment purposes, right, like you don't change your equipment often, so it's actually worth, um, worth investing. Yeah, worth hobby. yeah, worth investing. If you really like it, it's really worth investing. And the only thing that expensive is when you play in the golf course, yeah, because uh, per time it might cost up to few hundred bucks, few hundred ringgits for per entry for eighteen holes, but. Uh, you always can get you know valuable package packages like how we did today. We we book through a package and it you you can save a lot from there as well. And another way to save a lot of money is to join membership in that particular golf club. So you only pay uh, annual membership fee. So every time you play, uh, you know you, you you go to the golf club and play on it. You don't have to spend a few hundred bucks on it. Just have to pay on the membership uh, to activate it, right? But actually, I think for golf, right, uh, nowadays actually there are a lot of youngsters started to play golf. So when our friends even ask us like, why would you play golf? It's something where it tests your patience a lot. Yeah, I think this is really true because Vincent is someone which is more impatient than me. But 
surprisingly he is even more he even have more patience in golf than me so i'm the one that is when i can't play well i'll be like oh it's it's not going really well but it is really nice because it's very slow paced like no one is going to force you like you have to have a really nice swing just from the start so you just go on a go on with your pace and then you go to the golf course like even when you don't have a really nice swing you can still hit the ball and the ball will still go that's already good enough but i do really enjoy how it is like in the golf course and playing golf with him is like a new hobby that i've developed event uh through for a long time so we, i think we need a few more years just to you know like make, make our skills even more better yeah to develop our own skills <laughs> Yeah, so actually um, we just back here and we wanted to show you around the, the resort itself but uh, we'll show you in the next video so please stay tuned for the full resort video to show you what we have in the resort and what is the best thing to do here and of course, yep, this is the end of the video um, please like and subscribe for our video here and we see you in the next video Yep, thank you for watching and see you in the next video where we will bring you an explore around this Anantara beautiful resort over here Right, bye guys. We will also go around the resort, explore around, and show you more. We will show you, you know, what are the selections of their breakfast. And this is the most exciting part of the room itself. So, currently, right now, we are here at the beach, a pool area, which is an infinity pool facing the oceans.